take some catching. It's a Cleary cliffhanger. It's Arthur's. Oh, that nearly got away from him. Well, he took it on his fingertips. That breeze has picked up right to left behind the Panthers. And you see it move. That was a beautiful floater kick by Nathan Cleary. Caught on the fingertips of Arthur's. Well, you can see there's plastic cups and all sorts of things blowing across the ground. As is Reese Walsh. Walsh into the clear. Knocked over in an angle tap. Oh, he's come to life in the second half. Another extraordinary piece of individual brilliance. A tackle made by Tungor on Capewell. Now Flegler. Brisbane trying to hold this pen with momentum. Reynolds, short pass. Wrapped up well. Change over. Brendan Piakura. Ran the ball on the last tackle. Reese Walsh. And he's coming into this game using his footwork and his leg power. You see him here, left foot. The speed. Wow. Yeah, there's a change coming here, all right? It's, it's Reese Walsh engineered. Man, there's a man in the second half. Conger and Cleary again. Great tackle. Half back on half back. And Conger played very direct. He's given it to Nathan again. And Crichton, a dink over the top into the corner. And Taruva's chasing. Walsh is there. He's been tackled in the end. He's goal. in. Kick from Crichton. Tom. Precision. Oh, Flegler's in there. Crichton's in there. Hart is in there. Come Tom one, come all. As they sort it out in the middle. Now, Reese Walsh, he, he just missed his assignment early here. Tom, he was in the middle two. of the field, That's and when Crichton gets the ball, Tom. he just found himself out of position. You see here, Crichton gets the ball, kicks it, and Reese was walking in the middle. That's the fatigue of the game. Now, the Broncos, they'll be defending their try line again. Well, that previous set, Bill, that the Broncos had, you know, he had that gut busting effort. That of affect Reese Walsh there? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Adam. He's not immune to fatigue. Adam. He's feeling it. Tom, They're going to need him here because the, cool the fullback is essentially important Frankly, in the, mate, in the defensive line, feet, especially on the goal line. Do they go short again? Uh, they've got to go short. Adam Reynolds is really strong subtly. Kicks to his left. Time to run! He's kept it low towards the sideline. It's out on the full. There was a foot over the sideline. The they're saying and that. they're going to challenge it, I think. Well, this is incredibly hard to do by Nathan. You can challenge that. To actually, challenge, on the challenge. move. He's challenging this to see whether the foot was planted when he caught the ball. It looked Morning. like he got it right. Captain Charles from Brisbane. On-field decision out the full. So he's got to get his foot over the sideline before he touches the ball. So we get the right foot of Nathan Cleary. Yes. Oh, he takes it. up a position outside oh, of the it. field of play, and then he touches the no, ball. The not challenge is not about Nathan Cleary. He never misses. Nathan. The greatest grand final yeah. comeback is Melbourne's 14-point uh, comeback in the 99 grand final. The first game played here, they were 14-0 down. Penrith were down by 16. They could break the record... If they're able to come back and win this and have a look where they are. Moses Leota, tackled by Flegler. Seven metres from the Broncos line. Cleary slips it out the back. It was Farnworth who came racing out of the line and they've lost ground here. Good pressure defence by the Broncos. Tony Stags. Cogger and Walters come together. Seven minutes to go. No option out wide, so Garner comes back towards the middle. Last play. What can Cleary fashion? Out the back, tap on play. Crichton again. Crichton with a step. Crichton with a kick. And cut by Cobbo. Oh, I thought he's going to go 90 then, Cobbo. Wow. 
Oh, it's game on. What have we got left? Seven minutes. Oh, big collision. Kenny putting his body on the line. Any mistake by the Broncos here could be fatal. Now Staggs is feeling for the back of his head. He's playing for a crusher tackle. But the way Adam G's refereed this game, I think he's done an incredible job. I'm with you, Joey. He's I think up, they'll mate. play he's on up. here, just play the ball. Tackle two, wait! And Herbie Farnworth. What a performance. He'll head to the Dolphins next year. Will he take a premiership with him for the trip across town? Pass. Trapped just short of the 30. Carrigan. That'll be play for. The clock is ticking away. Reynolds says, get it out of here. Tot always awake to an early kick. He gets back and takes it. Not all wrapped up by Farnworth. Brisbane defending with everything. In both teams have got hardly anything left in the tank. It comes to Sorensen, and Crichton. He's looked dangerous with every possession. He's cut down right on the halfway. It's played to Cogger. Spencer Lenu back out there. Well, he's all had plenty of energy. Could he be a game breaker late in the piece here? Yo leaking with Cleary. Fires it away. It's with Luke Garner. Brisbane's defence retreating. Garner up to the 10. Farnworth in there. Arthur's in there. Last tackle, Penrith. Nathan Cleary. A kick pretty much up and down the same spot. I wonder if that brushed the Bronco. It's still the last. It's with Cogger. It's back for Crichton. Crichton trying to find the end goal. He's done it again. Oh, wow. An unbelievable play by Stephen Crichton. They'll get another set here, the Panthers. Luke Garner, he's at right centre. Isaac Tungler, he's come from the field. What a game. A death kick by Crichton to pinch another. He has to go short. He has to go short. Now, a reminder too. Should we need it, there is extra time before Golden Point. Reynolds, he's oh. trying to nail it. It was taken well. That was a stinger. And Martin, hold! We've only got four to play in the season. Can Penrith manufacture the greatest grand final comeback we've seen? Kenny looks one way and plays right. It goes to Edwards now. He beat Reese Walsh. He beat Billy Walters. Yeah. He couldn't beat Flegler. Liam yeah, Martin's busted on the right. Kenny Fisher Harris tripped no, over. No. Now Sorensen. There's no hole in the Brisbane defence right now. Two plays left on the set. It goes to Cleary. Nathan Cleary! Right. Well, he had to stand up, and he's just elevated himself from a champion. They were gone. They were absolutely gone with 20 minutes to go. And Nathan Cleary, with his side kick off the field, Jerome Luai, just said, come with me. He has willed Penrith back into this. He found space back on the inside. Harvey Norman replay. He just kept searching for a tied defender. And Nathan Cleary, wow. What a performance in this last 20 minutes. Look at that. Incredible. 24-all, kicked the cup right in front. It was 24-8 after 56 minutes, and Nathan Cleary has just elevated himself to grand final immortality. Oh, th this is special. This is a special performance by Nathan Cleary. Twenty-four all. Oh. Ah, the Telstra fan cam. The spotlight on the Penrith supporters. They were in tears.
minutes. 20 minutes ago, Brad Fittler, incredible. Well, half the crowd are standing on their feet, still applauding. And the other half have got their head in their hands, wondering what just happened. The big thing you've got to look at, there's still two minutes and 14 seconds to go. He'll wind this down a little bit, but the Broncos will still have a shot left. There's still time. There's still a game. Oh, there's his family. Well, I know he's sitting next to me, but the highlight of, of John's and Albert combining back in 97 goes down in the annals of great grand final plays. Well, the one we've seen from Nathan Cleary is right alongside it. He's put Penrith ahead by two with less than two to play. Well, this is one of the greats. Now, 2015 was a great grand final between the Broncos and Cowboys. This is right up there. And this man has been centre stage, Nathan Cleary. And the Broncos hit the lead and extended it. He took the responsibility on his own shoulders. Time will stay off. Blue Eyes has been off the field since the 50th minute. Well, there's no kicking to. Keep the time off. Adam Reynolds is waiting for the kicking to to come out. He'll go short to his left. Away, yeah. They've got to get the football back. Got a time now, run! It's one of the greatest performances on the grand yeah, final say, stage, say. but the game is we'll far say. from over. They were gone. Stay Two on. points, the difference now. Yeah. Now Reynolds will go short. It's up a Panther. It might have gone forward. It's play on, says the referee. It looked to have come off Dylan yeah. Edwards and gone forward. The Panthers will try to wind this clock down, but Brisbane should get at least a couple of shots. Lindsay Smith. It is barely believable what we've seen here from the Panthers tonight. Brisbane had them beaten. Edwards wheeling up the ground. Last play coming. There'll be a minute left. Can Reese Walsh manufacture a miracle? The kick up out wide. And it's taken by Arthurs. And Brisbane are being asked to go 82 metres to win the comp. They've got to find their speed. So Carrigan, he had to prop there. It wasn't a great pass. There's 40 seconds left. Reynolds now, away to Walsh, Walsh now wrapped up, he got the ball away, it's taken by Sorensen! Walsh played all of his cards at once and it's come unstuck. You can't believe this. It's the greatest grand final escape in the sport's history. Who called this team, the Penrith Panthers? Oh, they were gone, Billy, right? Wow. They were absolutely gone. This is their greatest feat, without a doubt. Penrith have done it! Over. They make it three and the debate is settled. This is the greatest team of the modern era. A fifth premiership for the Penrith Club. They have dragged it out of the ashes.